Hi, I'm Debbie. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please like, subscribe, leave a comment. And this is part two of my Pottery Barn dupes. So please stay tuned, watch the video, and I will let you know what I've done. Also, if you have any questions or comments, please drop them below. If there is something that you would like to see me do, please drop that below and I would be glad to do it. So, welcome, stay tuned. Here in this step, I am applying a second coat to all the pieces, and it's I'm using latex paint with baking soda. I have chalk paint as well, and I add a little bit of baking soda to that to give it more texture, to make it look more like a pottery piece. And this is me doing the second coat. a third layer or a third coat of paint this time I'm going to be taping off some pieces to add lines to add definition be creative do your own thing I have brown gray white I'm mixing paint with some baking soda to give it more texture to make it more pottery like you do what you like. You can add whatever you want to it. Some people add in gold. Some people add in other colors. This is just my take on it. So you do what you feel. You do what you feel is fun. Have fun with it. Do what you want. Here I'm just taping off the areas that I want to paint different colors to give it more dimension. I'm just taping off this piece and I'm using regular masking tape. I would recommend that you use painter's tape. It may give you a better feel. I did have some bleed through that I had to fix on these pieces. 
but overall, I, I think I like the way it came out. My tape is kind of old, but I just went with what I had on hand. Here I am painting, this is a tin can, and I did some gray already, now I'm adding the brown to it, give it more dimension. I also will be adding some twine to it. My plate, I'm going to be adding the brown to it. The, va the larger vase will have brown, as well as the smaller jar is going to have the brown in it. And the bowl that's gray already has white, and I'm going to add some brown to the line to give it a little bit more dimension. Hope you guys like it. Just making sure the tape is really tacked down on the part where I'm going to be painting to alleviate a lot of bleed through. projects what the pieces look like what do you think of them i had fun doing this and i would love to do more i love to bake i like to do all kinds of things so let me know what would you like to see me do how do you think this came out i really would like to have some feedback and let me know what you think i mean mckenna xo inspired me and this is my take on pottery barn so please let me know what you think in the comments below please like and subscribe and let me know what you'd like to see in my next video this is the final project this is the way i set it up i made these string of beads and i put a little tassel i had this wine uh, some dried flowers in the vases and I just 
I'd like to know what you think. The, the beads are different colors. Yes, the beads on Hard Reborn are $100 and they're all white, but mine are multicolored. Those are the thing of the colors that I used in my products. And my dried hydrangeas came out of my garden from last year. Just tell me what you would think. I think they came out nice. What do you think? Drop a comment below and so tell me what you think. Drop a comment below. Tell me what you would like to see next. Tell me if you were inspired to do something like this. And I would love to see what your projects are. So please, I'm new to this. Please give me some feedback.